Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy XII. This is Yu Chiang for this. Uh, last time we fought Dr. Sid and uh, kill and didn't kill him, but we found out he was going to be going off to Gear of Vagan. And uh, so yeah, but before we go off and chase him, I'm actually here back here in the Osmone Plains. Uh, there is a entrance to a cave system in here. Actually, not in this area, but the next area up that I want to go to, because in this cave system is an Esper that we can get. We could have gotten this a long time ago, but I kind of didn't want to go after him for one reason or another. Um, also, this guy, this Esper that we're going for, is flying. So bring people that can actually attack flying things. That's why I have Bosch and Fran and Pinello, since all since they are the only ones in my team that can actually hit flying enemies. So, actually, you know what? Screw it. I don't want to fight all these weak-ass peepers. So anyway, down here, we saw this before, is an entrance to out uh, I wanted Bosch. It, the Zatinian Caverns. Ow my face. Uh these guys down here, these enemies are actually quite strong. So Yeah. Be prepared. If you come here earlier you could come down here uh as soon as you enter Osmon Plains. But uh yeah. Since these guys are actually quite powerful and have a lot of HP for that early in the game, I didn't really want to come down here. It would take a long time to actually get through this place because of how freaking powerful these guys are. Um, and I know it's down here where I'm look what I'm looking for, but I don't know exactly where it is I'm going. So it might take me a while in order to get there. Uh, I do know the shape of the map, so if I do find it, I'll be like, oh hey, here's uh, the place we need to be at. Uh, is this it? No, this is not it. And these guys do like to teleport for some odd reason. Good lord, I hate these friggin' enemies. But Thundara will actually be of use down here, I, th I think. Actually, let's go ahead and get Pinello. Eh. Let's do Thundaga. Why? Because I can. Let's see how much more powerful... That's eh, a little bit more powerful. I guess I could use Ash until I get up there because she does have the Deathbringer. Might make this a little bit faster. But, eh, whatever. I'm gonna keep my party. As is. For the time being, anyway. Ah, oh, this is where we need to be. Okay. Yeah. Say hello to our next Esper friend. I'm going to be recruiting onto our party. He's the Esper of Wind, so... Yay. He actually looks pretty darn cool, if you ask me. A Dremelec. He's actually one of the weaker... Where is... Where is he? Ah, there he is. All the way over there. Yeah, and he does like to call undead things to him, so... Ow, quit blinding my face. He's actually... Yeah. 
He's actually one of the easier espers to get because he doesn't have a condition on him. The only thing is that he likes to fly. Ah, perfect defense. Why are you being that way? Evil bastard. Die. Oh, you're stopped. No, oh, that's not good. Well, this is not good. Oh, well, at least his friend's still here. Yep, she's still there. This could have gone a little bit better, but eh. Come on, Pinello. Oops. Um, yay. This could be going a lot better. Okay. Let's bring in Ash. Because we need to get in. Let's, there we go. We need to kill these corpses. Because, uh, yeah, they're kind of getting annoying. There we go. Quit casting Thundara. Stupid itch. That could have gone a lot smoother, but eh. I didn't really want to do a practice run and figure out the best strategy. I just wanted to kill him. <laughs> Yay! Dremelik the Roth. Cool. Alright, so where... Who do I want to give a Dremelik the Roth to? Let's see. With you, Vaughn. Shades of Black. Meh, don't really care. Cast random black magic. Uh, Soul Eater to Balthir, which is kind of meh. Kira and Raze? Ooh, that's actually quite useful, Fran. Uh, Bosh, you have nothing. Ash, you have nothing. Pinello. Uh, Femoral and the uh, Hand Bombs. I don't really care. So... That means, Fran, you get Cura and Rays. Sweet. Cura it will definitely come in handy. That's an uh, AOE cure spell, I think. And it's a little bit stronger than cure. So, Cura. Go for it. And also, instead of Phoenix down, we'll have you put Rays, since it's basically the exact same thing. Sweet. Cool. I should have gotten that beforehand. Oh, hey, zombies. Die. Holy crap, these zombies like to come up and quit coming up. I want to get Ash out of the party so I can get Fran in. There we go. 
All right, and with that, uh, let me go ahead and check and see what else we can do. All right, let's go ahead and head back to the sand sea, see if there's any uh, hunts that I can do there. And then once I do that, head over to and see Mont Blanc since we haven't, haven't seen him in a while. Sweet. All right, is there any hunts available? Yes, there are freaking crap tons of... hunts available. <laughs> also, when I was heading back to uh, here, Pinello actually did 12,000 damage to an enemy with one of her attacks. I'm just like, really? Holy freaking crap, I'm already breaking the damage barrier. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cool. Let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead and see where we can go. And again, I don't know if I will be doing all of these at all. So, yeah. Let's just say there are a lot of freaking hunts that are available to me right now. Oh. <laughs> uh, and, uh, yeah, this is gonna. This is just the. the beginning of them. Trust me, this isn't the most side quests that there are. <laughs> uh, once you get through Girovagan and uh, get on. Girovagan is actually like the third to last uh, required dungeon. And once you get through the second to last uh, required dungeon, holy crap, there are a lot of hunts. And if I were to do all of the hunts, this LP would be going on far too long that I would, uh, yeah. Surrender the axe. And I'm not gonna do that. I'm, uh, I'm probably gonna do the stuff that's in Nalbana, do all the hunts that's in Nalbana that just opened up, and then just basically call the hunts good there. Because once I get a certain skill from the hunts, uh, and I'm hoping that I'll be able to get it pretty soon. Alright, let's see. Come on, Blanc, where are you? Because once I have that skill, then I'll be practically unstoppable. <laughs> oh, yay. We've actually seen it, be seen it before. Zalera the Seraph of Death, or Death Seraph actually cast it on us. It's called Reverse. It's actually a really, really good spell. <laughs> uh, I'll explain more once we actually get it, uh, get into it. So yes, I did defeat King Bomb. And money and mallet, which I don't really care for. Oh, that reminds me. I need to go talk to those guys that are in the... Yeah. Yes, I do command more than four espers, I think. And you don't have anything worthwhile. Alright, cool. So there's one place that I want to stop by real quick before I go to Nalbana and do the stuff over at Nalbana. And I think this, this part is just me going to be getting uh, quests and all that fun jazz, so. But yeah, I, I think I'm going to try and get all of the espers, and uh, that'll be it. Let's see, where do I want to go? I want to go to the south gate, because that's where the teleport stone is. I need to get some more teleport stones, because I'm actually going through through them really fast. Let's see, teleport. I want to teleport to uh, Cedar Uplands.
because once we get here, we can actually talk to these guys, and if you remember these guys, yes, we did defeat the menace that is the Mandagoras in the Sochin Cave Palace. Sweet. Yeah, not worth it, but eh, whatever it is. It is what it is. And then Nalbana, where are you? Let's see if I rem I, I think I have a ton of uh, hunts in here, which, you know, talk to them, and they're actually really... Yeah, get, get the hunts, which means the next couple of parts will just be hunts, so, yay. Let's see. Pilgrim, do you have one? No, you don't. I think this guy... Oh yes, you do have one. Death Scythe! Sure, I'll go after Death Scythe. Necrohall of Nabudis. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be able to freaking <laughs> meet that big, uh, place now, now that I actually have decent healing moves. I, I forgot that... Uh, what's his name? Bosch had a healing move, so. <laughs> so, yeah, the, the Death Scythe likes to put sap on your people and also cause death, instant death, so. Yeah, Necro Hall of Nabudis is not a fun place to go. I mean, it has some pretty decent weapons in it, though. And armor. Yay, Atmos. Yes, I will go and hunt Atmos for you. And that's in the next area up, so I think I'll... I remember where that is, hopefully. Yes, I have heard of the Barheim Passage. Um, I have no idea where every... Do you have a hunt for me, Sharp-Eyed Man? No, you don't. I know there's a few in the Aerodome. Ones that I don't really care for. Yes, I've been overhearing you. Yes, I was watching you. What do you want, buddy? Sure. I'll... Okay. Bestiaries and all that stuff. Okay. Yes, I am here about Goliath. Where is it? Necro Hall of Nabudis. True. The hunt begins. Ah, good lord. I don't want to go to Necro Hall of Nabudis. Let's see. And then this guy. Morgan. Yes, I am going to go out and hunt Marks. Nebraeus Deadlands. Sure. Oh, I remember this guy. This guy is kind of... Eh. I remember that guy. Let's just say a lot of skeletons are in that area, and they like to respawn. So bring AoE attacks for that fight. Canelo will definitely in, be in my party on that one. Hmm. I think... Uh, yeah, I don't care. 
As of right now, I think those are the only ones that I'm gonna go for. Be those four. And once I do those four, I'll go ahead and see where else I'm at. I know where Atmos is, and he's the easiest one of those four. I Well, actually, I should rephrase that. I know of the general area where Atmos is. He's actually here in the Mosforan High Waste. So... Yeah, hopefully I'll be able to find him and take him down in this part. If not, then the uh, next part. Beginning of next part, so... I could look up if exactly where he is, but I'm not going to. Actually, you know, well, mm, I want to keep Bosh in the party just because of his healing. Ow, my face! Actually, you know what? Let's bring in Ash since she has the. Deathbringer, just to make things go a little bit faster. Yay! Oh, wow! 13,000! Did you see that? <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, good lord. Canelo, you are going to freaking rock this place. <laughs> oh, good lord. Well, I am going to go buy a map of this place. I think I don't have it. Actually, I do have a map. So, cool. I don't... So that, that'll make me tracking down this beast a lot uh, faster. So next time we'll go ahead and fight Atmos. And uh, yeah, until then, this is Yu Tiang for this signing off saying, keep things frosty.